Now we'll go down to the hub. And merchants. Well, let's lane our load a little bit. What can I do for you? I want to barter. I got some stuff to sell. You don't have anything to... That's kind of funny. Goodbye. Even if you're playing evil, do not attack them yet, unless you want the hub to jump you. Uh, south you see a large city. Outlying farms surround this town. There's life in the desert oasis. Yeah, the town, the other town doesn't have an idea. We just eliminated Junk Town. Hello, and welcome to the Fargo Traders. How can we help you? Looking for work. You're looking for work, are you? You look, you look all right. Well, you should probably talk to Butch. He's through the door behind me. What do you want? Uh, not to work for you. You sound like a pompous beep. I need to ask you a few questions. Time is money. Chit chat is not money. You hear about the job or what? Yep. Hot damn. Someone with guts. Done and done. Go talk with my second, Rutger, and get the details. You have any other barter? A7, 137, 100. That's good enough. Alright, um, thank you. That job pays 500 caps when you can tell Butch exactly what has ha been happening to all the caravans that have disappeared recently. So collect any proof you might find. I, I personally think it's those damn water merchants or those gun freaks of the Brotherhood of Steel. Butch thinks it's some claw of death or something. Check with Beth. She would know more about that. Alright, thank you. Bye-bye. Alright. Uh, just debating what route to go here. And we want to kind of start unloading this stuff. She gives a discount on stuff, but we're not going to be buying from her. So before we start actually doing any of the quests that I have planned, we're going to go ahead and unload some of this from our inventory stockpile, because we got a lot of stuff. Hi, welcome to Jake's. I found some great merchandise in stock. Feel free to look around. Uh, what are you selling here? High-end arms, best stuff you can find this side of the Brotherhood, and since the Brotherhood ha doesn't deal with outsiders, I gotta say I'm the best. I have a sniper rifle, and you'd be hard-pressed to find flamethrower fuel anywhere else in the waste. Oh yeah, I've got a Geiger counter too. Very rare. What would I need that for? What do you need Geiger counter for? Haha. -ha. Though it's been 80 years or since, since the bombs fell, there's still radiation around. You goof. You can't see it. Never could. But it's there. Heck, I'm willing to bet you've got some counts on you. Now. Everyone that lives in the waste has a few rad counts. And Goof, do you always insult your customers? If you think I'm going to buy something from you now, you're sadly mistaken. Tell me about radiation. Well, some call it phantom death, because that's what it is. You can't see it, you can't hear it, you can't even smell it. Basically builds up in your system, you never feel it until it's too late. The more trips you take to hot spots, the more it builds up, and it will never leave your system, ever. The rad just keep building up. Well, unless you can get a hold of some right away. Where can I find right away? I haven't seen it being sold in some many places. I didn't carry it. And I find I keep for myself. Sorry, any I find I keep for myself. Right up to um 
right up the street, there's a guy that may be able to help you. His name is Vance. Don't ask too many questions of him. Let's just say his area is expertise. Just tell him Jacob sent you and he should set you up fine. Sweet. Well, let's barter then. Combat shotgun. Oh, 20,000? Too many Christmas, that's expensive. Well, I have an extra one of these. I can sell that. I'm not going to use the Desert Eagle. Uh, five of these I got to sell. I'm going to sell all these. I'm not going to use flares. This ammo. BB gun. Definitely going to sell. I don't need another one of those pistols. Probably going to need that ammo though. But he sells it. Yeah, it's actually not that bad. I want a snipe rifle. 15,000. And I do want com this armor. 63,000. Oh, that. I mean, that's like 40 something. Assault rifle is pretty good. How much are stim packs here? 700. Holy shnikes. Yeah, he does char um, charge an arm and a leg for stuff. Although, I can just sell it and get the bottle caps. Trying to think if I want to get anything. I should be okay just selling this stuff. So it's going to take a little bit. Oh, almost perfect. 2894. Dang. That's a good trade. Thank you. I try to make good trades for you. Thanks for the info. Now, the one nice thing is he actually re gets his uh, money back right away. Their selection is good, but I'm looking for something with a little bit more punch anywhere it could go. We could probably die uh, gun runners over in LA Boneyard. They'll probably have something to suit your needs. I've got uh, Brother Steel packs some pretty hardware. Yeah, pretty powerful hardware too. So you might check them out. Let's go ahead and barter. Oh no, he doesn't. His bottle caps didn't uh, come back. That actually. That was a fix in fixed. It's a, it's a good gun, but I can't afford that. Got a lot of stuff to sell. Definitely need to keep the Mentats. Oh, let's see what I can pony up from this guy. Actually, that's all that I can sell right now. So we're going to escape. We're gonna done. Let's take it some of the stuff that I know I'm gonna sell. Oops, I need. I meant to keep one of those. Oh well. Oh, I did give him one. That was a bad idea. Whoops. Oh, I'm at capacity. Uh -huh. That's barter. No, I need one of those. Unless I get the combat shotgun. Alright. 3,790. I should get the sniper rifle now, maybe assault rifle, but that uses 5mm. Yeah, I think the sniper rifle is pretty much the gun I'm going to use until I find my BB gun. 15,000 though, I can't afford that. What can I afford? No, I'm just looking around. Well, I guess I'm going to have to go to Beth. It's all with her. I need my caps. As I said, I'm not saving the the vault, and that requires. Let's see how close is it. Uh, Bob, 
Hi, welcome to Bob's Iguana Bits. The family eating place may I take your order. Anything interesting happening at the hub? Well, the only thing new thing is that the children of the cathedral have taken over the hospital. It's pretty boring around here lately. Anything else? Give me an iguana stick. Sure. Uh, we got whole iguana on a stick for 20 bucks and our prime cut pieces for 8 bucks. Nothing right now. I'm on a diet. Smart decision. You could stand to lose a few pounds. Yeah, bleep you. Because of how I handled uh, uh, Doc Morbid up in Junktown, it looks like I didn't trigger the quest here. It's not really a quest. It's a little side bit. Because if you get, um, you can actually confront Bob about where he gets his meat. And then, uh, yeah, you get a little money out of it. Terrible business, those poor people. Those poor people losing their lives in such ghastly ways. Is there anything else I can do for you? Like, feed you, perhaps? Hey, yeah, got the water chip, no, but the water merchants don't need them. You must be new in town if you're asking about the water chips. Water is life, and you don't get much more powerful than life and death. Alright. Bye-bye. No, we're not talking to you. Uh, I've heard of you. You're the one that took out Killian in Junktown. Nice going. Gizmo must have paid you well for, for that one. What brings you to the hub? Looking for some work? Yes, I am, but first I want to barter. And get some stim packs. Okay, good. Stim packs and caps. That's what I'll trade for. Yeah. Start it there. Ugh. Twelve fifty. Okay. Perfect. Do I have anything I can sell for? It's forty. Good. Nope. Too much. That's fifty. That's good enough. Offer. Back to the conversation, please. And hello, welcome for watching. All right. What's the job and what's it pay? It's not skag work. You'll need to do it quick and clean. The boss will give you details, but it's more money than you'll make in a month working for the caravans. But only if you're good enough. We don't take kindly to failures, if you know what I mean. Sound well. Who do I have to kill? It's well. Would you like to accompany me downstairs? There are too many ears around here. Sure, let's go down. So, you're looking for a job. How fortunate. I have one that needs doing. Ah, but where are my manners? What's your name? Well, first I want to barter with you. See what you got. Two stim packs, I'll take those. Hmm. Need something really cheap. Or I can actually give up. Actually, what we'll do, we'll try pulling it up another way. Two forty. It's twenty-three short. So it's better to trade. None of these combinations work for that. So I'll lose thirteen caps, it's okay. Not the end of the world. At least hopefully not. I'm ingenious though. Well the pleasantries are now concluded. Do you wish to hear about the job? That's why I'm here. Background. There's a certain merchant who's how to phrase this not cooperating fully with the underground. And the job? Quite simple. Hunt down the merchant and his wife, and exterminate them. Not much for it. It's standard pay. 500 caps to start. Another 2,500 when the job is done. Will you do it? Absolutely. Very nice. The merchant lives in the Heights, on Barter Street and Thunder Avenue. Your initial pay will be handed to you on your way out. Sounds good. The 
merchant and his wife live over to the west from here. They're on the corner of Barter Street and Thunder Avenue in the Heights. They'll probably have guards. Try to be quiet about it and be sure you aren't seen. But if anyone does happen to make sure, they don't live to tell anyone about it. Once you finish your little errand, come back here. One more thing. Don't even think about going to the police. That's the worst mistake you could ever make. If you can, try not to attract their attention. When doing your work, they can be quite a pain sometimes. Alright, done, done. What do you want? I want to barter, see what you got. 66 caps. And done. I don't want anything. We'll beat it. If uh, you ever have um, high luck and about a 35% gambling skill, just hit up the craps table here and make a lot of money. Actually, that could have been another way I could have done this. Alright. Business hours only. What am I wait? 104? I only have 54 pounds free. That kind of sucks. Let's do this. If you're good, you're gonna turn them in. If you're evil, you're gonna go like this. After sundown, nobody is allowed in this area. The other guards won't even give you a warning. If they catch you, they'll attack. You better go back to downtown while your head is still attached to your neck. Will you barter with me? Hee <laughs> hee. Alright, I'll be on my way. It seems I have to wait till morning anyways. Mm. Let's take care of the merchants now. Let's see if... only have 7,000. That's going to be tough. Wait. Oh, they're down here. Wrong place. The water merchants. I think she's in charge. I don't care what they say. We need new parts. Oh, yes. Sorry. What can I do for you? Do you have a water chip? Water chip. Hmm. Oh, those old vault purifying control chips? Well, I'm sure I speak for the entire town when I say you won't find one here. Without a proper equipment, they're worthless. Only a vault or maybe necropolis would have any use for one. Why do you ask? Looking for a replacement. Really? Well, as you probably have heard, we supply a great deal of water through the area. I'm sure we could arrange to send a caravan up to your vault for a fee. How much are we talking about? Well, it's quite a distance away. 2,000 caps should cover the initial caravan. I'm sure your vault will have stuff to trade to keep us going for a while. However, with our current reserves, I'm guessing we'll be able to keep our vault going for an extra 100 days or so. It is quite a ways, but the vault's plenty of goods to reimburse you for your upfront money. How about 500 instead? Sorry, I can only accept full payment. Eh, alright. Oh. I don't have much to sell now. I gave it all to... What's his face? Ian. Alright, here's the money. Okay, I can start sending a caravan up to your vault today. Now you ought to know the caravans are pretty visible across the desert, so sending the caravans out that way is going to point a pretty good picture for anyone that might be looking for your vault. You still sure you want to send them out that way? Yeah, the vault needs the water. Okay, then start a few hours. The only reason I did that was to increase the um, time frame, which I'll show in a second. Sixty-three percent. That should be good enough. So now it's up to two twenty-seven. And there's nothing else I need to do down here. It's really not that much. Uh, hub bucks only two thousand. That's not that bad. There's the kid. Good. And as I have to, no, I have to do this all over again. Yay!
since I have to rest, what I might do is go trade for a book. Since I'm probably going to have extra stuff anyways. Yeah, I'm at capacity already. Hopefully she'll trade with me, even though it's night. Open the door, please. Thank you. Hi, welcome to the library. I don't think I've seen you around these parts before. What might you be looking for in the way of knowledge? What do you have done in the books? Let me show you my selection. We got some caps. Nice. And outdoorsmen. That's, uh... 10,000. Oof. I'm just gonna take one. 1600. Let's see. 1000. 2000. Perfect. Those things are expensive. Figure I would advance the time, might as well do it reading books. She doesn't restock her inventory now. Oh, that's... It's a new one. Science and... Re and uh, repair are good ones to have. I'm just getting the... Those because... I want to advance time. So... When you're traveling the wastelands, the higher outdoorsman skill you have, the faster you travel. That's what the reason is. And I'm up to 30% by reading those books I've read, so it's pretty good. And what time is it now? Okay, I can do one more book and then I'll rest the rest of the way. Let's see where I'm at with selling this stuff. 1800, 2000, perfect. Upper, dock. Yay, inventory. Good. Where is he in? Don't use dynamite. I'm sure there's a few points where you can make good use of it. Still. Yay, morning time. So it was actually two birds, one stone. 43%. Had to wait anyway, so. Can you ask some questions? Of course you can, don't be silly. What do you know about the Death Claw? Think that's what's taking the caravans. It could also be the brother of steel. They're a strange butch. Some people think it's the water merchants, but they're wrong. What exactly is the Death Claw? Death Claw is the most evil thing to rise out of the ashes after the war. Some say it's a powerful ghost from the war that haunts the land. It's no ghost. It's as real as you and me. It's 20 feet tall with teeth as big as your arm. Some kind of demon that found its way here when the world was engulfed in fire. Uh, do you know anything else about it? Well, I know the mutant, old mutant, yeah. I know this old mutant in Old Town named Harold. He's seen it. He's the only one that's seen it and lived. The only one that's seen it and lived? Uncle Slappy over in Old Town talks about it sometimes, but he's old, crazy old fool. Uh, what other questions about it? Uh, let's go back to the merchants, actually. That's all the info. Thank you. I'd like to sell something. Oh, that's right, you're working for a butch, you get 15% discount. Okay, I need those. And let's see what... How much did she have, though? Yeah, almost 2,000, okay. I'll make use of that. 1,600. I 
goodness gracious, I really don't have... I don't need more ammo. Not yet, at least. I guess that'll work. Perfect. Balanced. Thank you. Alright, Ian. You're gonna hold on to the rest of this stuff. Thank you for watching. I'd appreciate before you go if you could take a moment of your time to like, comment, subscribe, and share. Thank you very much. This is Ingenious, signing off.